Okay, let's look and see what uh, Graham's up to, Senator Graham. Okay, first of all, what's underneath of it all? He's playing to the audience. He's playing to the base. Other card, the first card to come out is, you know, he's out there for blood. He's out, he's out there for blood. Yeah, to protect his party, to protect the party. We got the family there, the Republican family. That's what he's out there to do. Okay, uh, what we have going into it, Queen of Pentacles, I would say, you know, again, Mercer. Mercer, yeah, underneath of it, he wants to put an end to this. Okay. Above it, yeah, he's going to carry a big stick and beat beat the people over the head that are coming forward to think. And he thinks, you know, again, he wants to see Kavanaugh ferried out of this situation. We just need to ferry him out of the situation, okay? <laughs> so let's continue forward to see what else we get. Yeah, so what we have on this, this is about, again, the lovers, this stuff coming forward, the sexual allegations, okay? And uh, our Mercer, whoever the woman is behind it, saying, come out strong, come out fighting, come out, you know. Underneath of it, Again, he's there. The Republicans are all out there to put a, all the energy and all the club clubs drama to uh, sway people. To yeah, again, he doesn't want to see this come to an end. He wants to put an end to their. If he had his way, they wouldn't testify. You know, but it's like. Uh, waiting to see what is going to come out of it, what's gonna be handed throughout this thing. Yeah, everything's up in the air. He's feeling everything's up in the air, so much stuff, it's like the things are coming out of the woodwork. Everything is coming out of the woodwork now. And, you know, they were so self-satisfied with everything, really thought they had it in the bag to begin with, but these women are coming forward, okay? These women are coming forward in power. They're not backing down, okay? And again, he just wants to get a temporary win. He wants to get a temporary win, you know? And he's doing whatever he can to disarm, disarm them and to get a victory, you know? But uh, let's see what happens up here. Yeah, so he's again out there speaking. This is the one where he's coming out with the big club, coming out with the big club, you know, with the emotional level for Kavanaugh, you know. But again, you know, he needs to look deeper. He needs to look deeper, you know, because this isn't going away. Women are rising up and women have had enough and they're going to stand up. <clears throat> women are going to stand up. Let's see. Underneath of it, yet again, same thing. He's wanting to uh, put an end to this going forward for the Republican Party. You know, trying to skew the narrative, put something new into the mix, the, the, uh, yeah. Yeah, but, you know, it's, again, it's not going to happen. This nonsense that they've got going. Yeah, again, he's trying to see what he can get away with, what if they can sway. Because <clears throat> they don't want to look, they don't want to see the truth of it. 
They want to be blind to it. They want to cross it. They want to stop it. They want to block it. They don't want to see. <clears throat> because rapidly coming, rapidly coming, <clears throat> yeah, <clears throat> the women, three women. <laughs> that was perfect. <laughs> <clears throat> rapidly coming are the three women. Okay. And these women are not backing down. They're talking about the the revelry, the drinking, the partying, the you know, that Kavanaugh's not the squeaky clean choir boy. What they're saying, and they want to bring balance to it. <clears throat> Cause they know what's on the line. So they're coming out with a big club. You guys think you got a big club? Well, we got a big club too. Okay? And we're not afraid to come out and speak about it. And may he all fall down, okay? So, yeah. <clears throat> so that's what I see with Kavanaugh. And, yeah, he's worried with these women coming forward. He's doing what he can to sway it. He's trying to, again, stick up for the party and, and uh, put as much uh, doubt in people's minds as possible. You know, none of these women said that that Kavanaugh was a rapist. Basically, he's a he's a uh, exhibitionist and a uh, somebody that wants to watch, that sets him up, makes him feel like a big man if he can set these women up. Okay. So again, she didn't say he was a rapist. They said he was there. He was helping to spike the punch. He was there, you know, setting these women up to be raped. Okay? And I don't care if you're not if you're not the rapist, if you're sitting there watching and setting him up. It's just as creepy. Sorry, it's creepy. Okay. So uh yeah, that's uh what I see behind Graham. Graham's uh, for the party. He's going to, you know, put out what he can, the spin he can. And they're worried because the three women are coming forward. And they should be worried. So let me close this out. I want to see what they're saying. That uh, Trump is venting and ranting to Macron on trade. Oh, what a surprise. I thought it was particularly... Uh, interesting when they laughed at him yesterday <laughs> so i may have to watch uh do a reading and see what's the outcome of the uh un laughing in his face yesterday when he said that he's done more than any other administration ever in the history of the united states <laughs> yeah right and what planet are you on <laughs> loopy loo <laughs>